Hello people, I just got the new vector and I'm gonna open it now. This is happening one day before the app is gonna be released. Um, it came in this uh, box, protected by this white um, protection and the shock. And oh, this is gonna be fun with only one hand. Yeah. So basically, this is the vector box. In this box, we got anything more than than the protectors to fit it. And here is the robot. It came with this plastic protecting the box. And I think we have a paper here. So basically, Anki is sending this paper for mm, and say thank you and a little bit of explanation about uh, what what is next. So basically, once the app is released, I'm gonna be able to connect the robot, and um, this is basically gonna happen. So the first uh, the first few days, the robot is gonna be uh, in version software one, and then they will change uh, when the release for for the uh, general public is done. Um, they are gonna update the robot to version one dot two. This is not written here. It's on Twitter. Someone post me what Anki say to the um, to the people in Quick Starter. But here is the welcome letter for people who bought it on London, like me. So let's gonna take it out. Again, it's not that easy with one hand. Hmm. So here it is. The box. A few images all of us have seen in the videos. Here is what the box says. It's again a little bit of what they said before. And here we have more information, like more tech, more tech, techy. So it's in English, this is French, and this is German. So probably it's the countries where they are gonna start to sell it. So basically, here in the tag they say it's EU. And all the all the brands and small letter. Okay, so let's gonna open it. Mm, I haven't done it, so uh, uh. okay. Let's gonna try to do it. I don't have a scissors or anything in here, so just be patient. Oh, I'm gonna break it more. Okay, I'm gonna take some some scissors. I got a knife, so let's go to open it. There is it. So put it far away, and that should be. Oh, let's gonna see what's inside. Hmm. Okay. Knife again. There is it. Awesome. So I feel the box is quite premium. I would say you have bought an expensive toy or something because it's actually it actually feel, feels like they have taken care a lot of the box. Okay. Wow. It's actually quite cool, I've been weeks waiting for it and here it is, finally, so many times I have seen it in videos, wow. Uh, I will say it's even smaller than, than I expected, 
I knew I knew it was really small, but I didn't know it was going to be that small. That's even less than than my hand. It's wow. Okay. Wow, it's actually heavy. Well, it's not it's not super heavy, but it's not how to explain. It's not like it's heavier than than your phone, and it's smaller than your phone. Like if you think on how long it is. Okay, so this guy's gonna be live tomorrow probably. Hopefully, it's quite nice. So see how this is built. In here we can see the four sensors and for for the robot not to drop. One, two, three, four. That's quite cool. Wow, it's very heavy. And this is the microphone array and the and the, the touch sensor. And this is the speaker here. Awesome. This is gonna be very, very cool. Yeah, you can see that the dynamic is much heavier if it wants to do this, like onto the front, like falling to the front and falling to the back. Yeah, so you can see like how the weight is designed for the robot to be able to, to do some fun stuff. This doesn't look like really, I mean, I think it's okay for what is designed, but I I will say that it's not really strong. I mean, you don't, you can't expect to put the way there. Okay, let's gonna keep going. Okay, so here we have the cube. Whoa. So probably this is for the battery to to um, to not spend the battery now, so you can see, you can feel it's really uh, this this plastic in here sticks into the table, so so this is actually what happens. So probably the robot can just come. Hmm. Well, it has to be now that you do it manually. The robot needs to to do a lot of um, needs to be strong to to boot this up. It's not that, as I say, it's heavier than you expect. Here is the base. So here is where the robot is gonna recharge. It's connecting to the base, so you cannot um, unplug it. And it's just normal USB. So we are gonna be connecting it soon. And then probably this is just for some t shock. But that's it, good to know. In here we have still this gel for the hum humidity and water. And this is the instructions book. Okay, so first thing, um, we are gonna be doing is to connect this to the electricity and see what vector says. I know what to expect because I have seen it on, on Twitter. Everybody posting the photos with vector, really cool. I will post mine. <laughs> um, um, I just want, want to see it by myself. Come on, go away. You know, okay, wait. Now let's go to connect it. Mm -hmm. Come on, Not this way, this way. Cool. Okay. Don't expect anything cool. Oh yeah, yeah, there is light there. So that light is blue to light. So probably this is the battery state, the state, the state of charge. So it's actually now oh, something has moved. 
No, there's nothing in there. Oh, there's it. Oh, okay. I don't know what the number means. Key 8, G4. I don't know if it's an activation number. So now, okay, so we have seen that light to be blue. Now they are green. So I think um, that's all we can do for now. Let's go to take a look to the book, to the manual. Oh my god, why is it so difficult to do things with only one hand? Okay, there I see it. Quick start guide and product information guide. Quick start guide. Again, English, French, German. Get set up with vector. What to include? The robot, I got it. The charger, I got it. The cube, I got it. What I need? You need the phone. I uh, actually the phone. I'm recording this. I go to dot four gigahertz gigahertz um, router, and I got a USB adapter that is actually working. Place vector in the charger. Green light indicates charging. True. Star it's charging. Compatible compatible with most USB power adapters. Okay, actually that's right, this is the one I got. Okay, download and launch the Vector app. So this is the issue right now. The app is not released yet. We need to wait. Hey Vector, do a trick. What's the weather? My name is... Check the app, the app for more things Vector can understand. You are having trouble? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Get to know your robot. So it's it's HD camera. So the camera infrared sensor. I'm gonna disconnect it. Oops. Infrared sensor probably is this port in here. Uh, power button. Oh, so this is a power. Yeah, this is a button there. Okay, the touch sensor and the four uh, microphone array to know the direction of the sound. Cool. Uh, Nothing to see here and other languages. Cool. And then, well, we got this small, uh, that's boring. English, the cube is a uh, low frequency Bluetooth. A uh, low, uh, I don't remember what BLE stands for, but it's Bluetooth, low something. Uh, 5 gigahertz is not compatible, but that's okay because 2.4 gigahertz is still quick. Mm. I hope, yeah, I think I will. I know, I don't think I'm gonna have problems with the Wi Fi. If so, I will search for some extender or something. So, we, here we can see Europe, European Union, and stuff. How to change the batteries on the cubes. Mm -mm -mm. Information about the company, and this is French, 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 French from Canada, German, German, oh, Spanish. Uh, okay, that's that's really cool. It has a Spanish on it because the uh, an Italian. Because the the box doesn't say anything about the other, about other other languages, so it has um, Netherlands, Danish. So probably it's something about Europe, Nor Nor Norwegian. Probably something 
they need to add all the languages in the European Union, or most of them at least. I'm not sure about that. But <laughs> we have, sorry, I don't know if it's Chinese, I guess it's Chinese. So good to know. Maybe, maybe Vector is coming to other languages as well. That's all. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Um, you can learn something new about Vector. See you soon. Well, for sure, if you like the video, please like. If you want to know, if you want to know more about Vector, please subscribe.